What our mission is, is to try to save the 200,000 pictures that Pablo Bell took over his lifetime from roughly 1910 till about 1955, 1965 rather, so 55 years. There's many, many, many um, of, the, of the negatives that he has that are still in great deterioration state because they are cellulose nitrate. So for a couple of decades, cellulose nitrate was the film being used. It was flexible and uh, yet it's very flammable and very dangerous film. Pop uh, himself, a little bit of background on him, he came from uh, Pennsylvania and it taught himself to be a uh, cameraman. Well, that's back when they were using these little old pinhole cameras and various things of that nature. He covers weddings, he covers uh, kids' parties, adult parties, uh, new cars, uh, new houses, parades, um, outside of a business uh, or inside. And the mountains and the agriculture and so forth was a, was a great fertile field for him in the business of photography. This central San Joaquin Valley was a boom town and they were booming at that time and it was it was the mystique and the allure and the romanticism of going to California. But look at that look at that busy town. It had cars, pedestrians, um, trolleys. Trolleys for God's sake. He chronicled what America looked like when it was growing up. During World War II, when the Japanese Americans were rounded up local Japanese Americans were taken to the fairground as an assembly center and they stayed there in some rough barracks. So after uh, they pulled out and gave the fairgrounds back to the city, there was no memorabilia. Pop had taken pictures all those centuries of years and we were able to make a beautiful little booklet of the history of the fair. It's the only one there is, the only one you'll ever be. No one ever sees these pictures that aren't just blown away. They're, they're, they're so excited to see this history. This is history not only of Fresno, but this represents the history across the United States. This is what America looked like when it was growing up. Can't say that enough. This is a, a long gone, long forgotten time. It was a different time.